Meghan Markle Royal Baby, Why Meghan Won't Be in Public Often Soon After Birth Revealed Meghan Markle has not shied away from the spotlight since her marriage to Prince Harry last spring. But in the weeks ahead of giving birth, she kept a low profile. A childbirth expert has revealed why Meghan Markle may wish to take her time before appearing in public again. Giving birth can put enormous strain on the body, and while Meghan was without doubt well prepared, she'll probably want to rest at home with little Archie over the next weeks. Childbirth expert, Dr. Jane Leonard, explained why first-time mum Meghan may be experiencing a physical and emotional roller coaster following Archie's arrival. Dr. Leonard told Express.co.uk, the first few days postpartum, after the birth, are the most special and challenging for any mother, especially new mums. She continued, Megan, like any new mum, will need time to recover and also get her head around tasks such as breastfeeding, nappy changing, and basically looking after a newborn, including herself. Dr. Leonard also warned about the stresses of breastfeeding and the risks of baby blues many new mums experience due to hormones changing after giving birth. She said, immediate hormonal changes occur post-delivery which can lead to baby blues. Breastfeeding can be stressful, hard and also painful if there was a tear, or the mother has an episiotomy, stitches could be healing and feel uncomfortable, not to mention having to go to the toilet and if the birth was traumatic you really need time to recover mentally. Dr. Leonard stressed that Meghan may want to rest and let her body recover before re-entering the public sphere. Childbirth expert Catherine Graves has taught midwives who work at the private Lindo maternity wing, where both Princess Diana and the Duchess of Cambridge, Kate Middleton had their children. Catherine explained why Meghan stayed out of the media spotlight ahead of giving birth. She told Express.co.uk, towards the end of the third trimester, a mum's natural instinct is to slow down. Her body needs to produce as much oxytocin, an essential birth hormone responsible for softening and ripening the cervix, kickstarting labor and ensuring mum's contractions are working their very best, as possible. Oxytocin is a shy hormone, and will need optimal environment for her body to produce the amount she will need to support her fully in having a comfortable and possibly pain-free birth experience. When quizzed about how she was finding motherhood, an elated Megan told journalists on Wednesday, It's magic, it's pretty amazing. I have the two best guys in the world so I'm really happy. As her husband held their son, Megan added, He has the sweetest temperament, he's really calm. However, the pair reckon it's too early to tell who the baby takes after more. As they both laughed, Harry said, I don't know who he gets that from. Meghan added, he's just been the dream so it's been a special couple of days. When will Meghan Markle be seen in public again? Childbirth expert Ems Graves said that while Meghan may feel like she can take on the world straight after giving birth she should be given space to return to the media spotlight in her own time. She said, Often new mothers get a huge boost of oxytocin immediately post-birth which makes them feel like they can take on the world. Which is probably why Kate looked and acted so energetic on the steps of St. Mary's Paddington. Other mothers, prefer to stay in more comfortable clothing and take a gentle stroll, while some prefer to stay in bed, each option is a valid choice. No mother will know what she wants until the day arrives. No doubt though that Meghan will be well looked after and supported as she emerges back into the spotlight as a mother.